to mind the camera here because it's just blocking this stuff. I think you'll you probably get a sense of what what I'm doing. Uh, because on screen it'll show you what I'm doing. It worked. Okay, great. Hey, uh, thank uh, Hypatia. That was not my key. That was Hypatia's key. I will. I will ask you for help when I need it. Have you guys have Have you guys seen the end of this game? Ah, thanks, Britsigor. How's the sound balance also? So what I think I had to do was um, refill this battery, and I actually had an idea. I had an idea. I don't know if I explored this before. Cemetery. Does the uh, sound balance sound good? Oh, dust. Wait a second, how do I get... How do I get back to the tomb? Oh, you guys are awesome. I'm just following your lead. Mumbo jumbo, mumbonius, etc., etc. Okay, right, okay, that's how I get back. The portal. So, I can zap something. So, I was wondering if maybe... That's how I could. It's an old discharge battery. Does it sound it's good? It's an old discharge is, is, battery. Are the voices the voices are a bit too loud? I think. Pet the dog, then give the dog bacon. Taco Bell sounds good. I wonder. Can I drop it? It doesn't work with that. I'm tired of you pushing me around. Am I on the, for those of you that know this game, am I on the right track? Do I have to zap the battery? To charge it. Remember I got the radioactive waste in the trophy. Cookie has no idea. I can't give the battery. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. If I zap the battery, it will charge. I can't... I don't think I can zap her. There's no... There's no option. Judge Hammer, yeah, I totally understand. Lurk away, my friend. Thank you for stopping by. And thank you, everyone. Uh, Where's there, my sarcophagus? It's Why lurking. Why does Brother Chuck get one and I don't? Maybe it's because really appreciate no one it. found my body. Franklin wanted to uh, change the factory 
That's what we don't know. We don't know, like, who killed Franklin. I can't remember exactly how Franklin died, though. I think it was in the hotel. That's where we got the battery from. Pretty sure I can't... I can't leave the cemetery. Some weird power is keeping me close to the portal to the hotel. I can't get over there. Hmm. Yes, get another beer. Always, yes. I think I short circuited it. Dolores didn't want to run your stupid factory. What if I... I need a place to put the battery. What kind of beer? <laughs> That's a good question. Can I put it in the sarcophagus? It doesn't work with that. It does not work with that. You're on a need to know basis with my card. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm looking. I'm gonna call the hint. I wanna try calling the hint number. Stay out of trouble. Where's where's that number? Okay, she has the phone. Isn't there like flyers for the hit number? Detective Angela Bray, senior agent. It's my badge. You got the beer. Now can we know what kind it is? Okay, what's the hint line number? Uh, four, four, six, eight. Okay, let's see what happens. Welcome back to the Hintron 3000. How can I help you? I need a hint. Something about getting into the... Okay, this is interesting. Uh, how can I charge Although the Franklin is good with electricity, he won't be able to help you out in this case. Okay, so I was on the wrong... I was going down the wrong path. You need to find some place with a strong electrical current. You okay. haven't found the location yet, so consider waiting until later and doing other things first. Oh... Thank you. Goodbye. Oh, I need to do other things first. Okay. I haven't found the location yet. I like it. Okay, I still don't know what to do. It's my father's old pocket watch. Good as new. God, the sound, uh, the sound balance still sounds off. <sighs> I'm never wrong. So I'm guessing we have to get into the pillow factory to do the thing.
Okay, let's get everyone back to the pillow factory. Pretty sure it's uh, shorter than Persona 5. So is it this thing? Oh, right, wasn't I? Didn't I get the, the security? Didn't I get like um, a two? Hi, Ransom. So this door over here or something? I did. It's a rare PF001 tube. When those security lights are all green, the door can be unlocked. Okay, so that's what I have to figure out. I have to figure this out. What is this, though? I got the tube. I have to turn all these green. See, I thought that, uh... One, two, three. See, I thought that maybe I had to move this out of the way because one of the timed locks is there. Yeah, it looks like there's something I need to... I need to put something, like, here. Alright, I need another hint. No, I can't get here with, uh, with the zapper. I should write this number down. Um... 4468. I need another hint. Sorry, guys, I'm just... I'm gonna be getting lots of hints. Unless you guys know, and you can give me a hint. Oh, the watch, maybe. Welcome back to the Hintron 3000. How can I help you? Yeah. I need to move a truck. Um, security times, maybe. Where is time box You can four? find a map on a wall that shows you the locations of all the boxes. Ah. Uh. Thank you. Goodbye. I'm pretty sure the last one's behind that truck, though, right? Wouldn't that make sense? Or fix! List of announcements whenever you are streaming on Pink Sock. Yeah, sure, uh, Morphix, absolutely. I would appreciate that, thank you. You're talking about, um, uh, I love Kill Bill, Nikki's uh, Discord, right? That would be great, thank you. Maybe it stopped in the time that you're supposed to enter? Oh. It's my father's old pocket watch. Good as new. See? It's a map of the abandoned factory. There's one there, which I think is here, and the other one is that indentation, so it's behind the truck. Yeah, I decided against the YouTube gaming thing. There's just more people are watching me here, so I might as well do it on Twitch. So it's definitely here, right? Oh, Twitch Ember, thank you for the bits. So I need to move the truck. I need to fill the battery. That's why, I, that's why I'm so confused. Good. How are you doing, Christopher Odd? Welcome back to the Hintron 3000. How can I help you? G -g -g great. We have been doing some organizing, editing on Nikki's Discord, and making a few things automated. Oh, cool! What are you? Um, so you're you're automating when people go live? It announces it on um, on Discord. How are you doing that? Because I would I would like to do that as well. That'd be cool on mine. Pick up the, the battery. It looks like it isn't charged. Yeah. 
You haven't found the location yet, but you can get to it from the forest trailhead. Oh, the forest trail. Thank oh, you. Okay. Goodbye. Okay. I see. So it's actually a whole different location. To the bot I added to the server. Oh. If you want to just message me other Okay, sure. Yeah. Okay, cool. What uh what what bot is it? I can I'm sure I can figure it out. Actually, I bet you I might be able to use even the bot that I currently have to do it. Turns out carrying twelve Yeah, I have me six. Okay, cool. I'll look up how to do it. Turns out carrying 12 bags of books and paper into the roof is hard work. For sure. So there's more to this place than I thought. I have no idea where to go though. Okay, we're back out to the beginning. Uh, Twitch and seal. Okay, cool. I'll check it out. If I keep going to the right. What? How does that make any sense? Back to the beginning. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. If I go, if I go right back out. First one every time. God, it's really gonna make me do this. Ah, oh, thanks, thanks, Warfix. I appreciate that. Fuck. Get a minute, uh, check out uh, the change and tell me what you think. Okay. Oh my god. Do I have, even have a hint of what to do? Lane wolf, girls and and boys. Follow Saria's song. What is what? What does that mean? Um, I'm gonna call the hint line again. <laughs> Ocarina of Time? Welcome no, I've never played it. Tron 3000. How I can have I never help played you? it. You haven't found the location yet. You should find out where all those people are going in the forest. Thank you. Goodbye. We have to follow the people. Fuck, that makes sense. Everything makes sense once I hear the solution. It all makes sense. Also a bit loud still. I can never get the I can never get the sound balance right in any game. I don't even know if it's my fault. Yeah, the people you'll see. Someone's gonna walk in. Remember, did you see the pizza guy? Yeah, but I think I need I think I need someone to walk by first.
Okay, you need to go to another area. Julie, what's up? Are we nerds? I don't think we're nerds. I think we're really unnerdy. There we go. Serious? I have to wait here again? What do you mean? I went. I, I came in right as. There we go. Cool and sophisticated fellows. That's better. Did I not go in right after he came in? Okay, this guy. Oh, maybe? Oh, I have an idea. Oh my god! I just thought of something on my own. They're gonna walk into that, and it's gonna leave a foot. It's gonna leave, leave a trail to follow. Oh my god, I feel so good. I fucking solved something on my own. Yes! Yes! <laughs> I just dumped the radioactive stuff into the puddle. I can't step in it myself, though. Honestly, when you solve a puzzle in these games, you f oh, there it is. You feel so good. I mean, I solved half the puzzle. Because they're so convoluted. Woody's Pizza Shack. <laughs> They're going to a pizza shack in the middle of the woods called Woody's Pizza Shack. Ouch! Okay, there we go. <laughs> they all just wanted secret pizza, yeah. It's a pizza van, but I can't get to it with the gate closed. It's a security keypad. It's a lock, bolted, and electrified gate. It's a pizza van, but I can't get to it with the gate closed. <laughs> okay, no. Ah, it's like way on the other We could have just gone to some the other path. <laughs> I ran, I ran. 
Whichever Woody's wood. It's electrifying. See, the battery just needed a big old jolt. Anyone remember that? It's a heavy duty restraining strap and bolt. I can't reach that. It appears to be the on off lever for this electric. Big old jolt. It's now in the off position. Like I remembers. <laughs> yeah, this is a Twitch Plays at the Bleed Park. Nailed it! Okay. Does anyone, okay, aside from Blecko, does anyone know what that's from? This is some, this is some OG shit right here, right there. I still have no idea what to do with this. Um, I wonder... It's a special tool to remove vacuum tubes in the TX and they better leave it be. No, no one else knows. It's from um, Techno Babylon. He was, he like, it was just a, it's a game like this, like a point and click from Wadget Eye Games. And um, one of the main characters carried around a, um, it was like a taser, I think. And anytime he tried to use it, use it on something, he, he would say, <laughs> give it a big old jolt, give it a big old jolt. So he used to, I used to spam that and um, it was kind of like a running joke that uh, I just needed to use the, the big old jolt on something. And it ended up being like the final solution to one of the puzzles was to use the gun on something. <laughs> I couldn't figure it out. I had to look. I think I had to look it up or something. I don't want to bust all that. Yeah, it was kind of like that. I liked uh, Primordia. Primordia is really good. Yeah, I would highly suggest uh, playing it. Um, fuck. I don't know. Push. I can't push that. Any idea? Okay, so there's four of these locks. They all say 0505 on them, and I can't do anything with them. It looks like there's something here. So, someone was suggesting the pocket watch. Aha! Who suggested that? That was Cookie. So, do I have to adjust it to 0505? Or is it like 0404? Cookie, you're damn good. Can I go backwards? No. Can't be, oh, it says increments. It's increments of five. It could it be 2020 because it's four times five. Shard light wasn't, yeah, it wasn't the best. Is it go to 20? Probably not, eh? 12 and then it goes back. Hmm. Not leaving Dad's watch behind. I need to find the correct time to set it to. Let's go to number one. Uh, it could be a 24 hour clock. Oh, I see. So it sets this to whatever the watch is at. 420. Nope. <laughs> 
Um... Shit. I need to find the correct time to set it to. Maybe there's something in Chuck's journal. There's only one hundred like 144 combinations, why not just guess? I'd like to try to figure it out first. And then I could brute force it, maybe. Um 11.38, no. See any times? It's my father's old pocket watch, good as new. Forty-five eighty. What do you mean? I think on the picture. I was cute as a kid. I miss dad. There's his watch in the photo. What else? Do we have any other clues? I think we're just carrying around this this starship in a bottle. Oh, the watch in the photo? Magnifying glass? Hmm. No. It looks like it's, um, one hand is pointing straight up and one to the right. So that could be, that could be 1215. I was cute as a kid. I mean, evening ransom. Miro say, I'm going to go because I'm hella confused and can't keep up. All right, Miro, thanks for stopping by, even though you can't hear me. That's it. That was a good suggestion. I could try that. I actually don't know why. That was just pure, that was just pure, like, that was just pure luck. That was pure luck. <laughs> I don't, I don't know why. I don't know why it worked that way.
So it's gonna be, it's because it'll take them five minutes to walk from one to the other, I guess. <laughs> Look for 720 in a clue somewhere, maybe I figure out where the rest of the clues are. Yeah, I would, I would, I would say it's like what time he came into work. I think that makes the most sense, but I, maybe we read that somewhere, but I don't remember. Ha! I'm not cheating! Bot, why are the bots locked? Oh, because of a uh, subscriber thing? I am the greatest Nui Park player! Pure skill. Wait, what's that? Nothing. I get no victory votes for that? That's the wrong door. Progress is, let's save that. Damn right I get victory achieved. Sometimes you gotta be lucky to be good. It's a large red button. The doors moved a little bit but stopped. They must be stuck. They didn't open any further. I think they're unlocked. Get over there, Ransom. Smoke weed every day. Oh, Just a little drink the entrance. I can't stay long. Bostro, thank you for the 420. Can't stay long, that's cool. I better stay out here and help go I better stay out here and help guard the entrance. I better stay out here and help guard the entrance. What? What do I do? Okay, maybe I have to Reset. pick the right. Whoops! Crap. I, I have to pick the right people. No, no, not you. Not you. Not you. Not you. She opened just a little. Reset. I think we want to send her in. It opened a little more. Maybe I don't know. I think someone could squeeze through now. I think I can squeeze through the yes! now. Yes! Yes! Holy! Oh, you said it, Plum. This can't be. It's not possible. What have you done, Uncle Chuck? Ah! That's awesome. <laughs> Those look like bouncing wings. 
Shut up, Ransom. <laughs> Did you just say those look like bouncing wangs? <laughs> Um, okay. Oh, we can go down. Big floppy bouncing wings. <laughs> I gotta go and do some cliffhangers like this. The cliffhanger that lasted exactly like 10 seconds. Now the music's too quiet. This is just, this is the game. I'm guessing we can't get through there. I can't go out there. Those SRO-1 robots would kill me. I'll need to find a manual to reprogram the robots without killing us all. I can't go out there. Those SRO-1 robots would kill me. I'll need to find a manual to reprogram the robots without killing us all. SRO-1 robots, okay. Where can we get a manual, ladies and gentlemen? For those of you that have been watching. How do I reprogram them? Uh, get another one, Prince. Absolutely. I'll solve your problem. Ask your mom. Thanks, Finny. Or the library. You're, you might be right. It might be ThimbleCon. Dig in! This is Uncle Chuck's Indextron 3000 library filing lookup system. It uses the... I see there is a manual on the SR01 security system. It's in section 2.1. 2.1. Stories for robots. Dig in. You think it's gonna be lost? How to program a droid? Can't seem to be able to stop listening to Randa Red. That isn't a problem. Yep. Who read? Oh, maybe it's a specific. Droid. There it is. Okay, the SR-0101 security robot is the most aggressive and secure robot for sentry and protection duties. It can guard anything from simple rooms to large factories with the complete confidence of a Pillotron 2. Its advanced forward, backward, and side-facing radar provides complete coverage of the surrounding area. The SR-1 has been custom programmed to ignore the three laws of robotics. It is extremely dangerous if used incorrectly. It is advised that a complete course in SR-1 certification is obtained before attempting maintenance. We'll be fine. Easy access remote jumper programming box can be used to customize the type of guard duty you require. Any mode from passive monitoring scheduled uh, deterrence to seek and destroy. YouTube.com slash seek and destroy 0011. Excellent YouTuber. Every two or three weeks, the robots should be shut down for maintenance by jumpering the red jumper at E34. Okay. I'm writing this down. Red E34. Green. Welcome to the future. Oh! Vinny gifted a tier one sub to Falstro. Oh my god. Welcome to the future, Roo. But Vinny, you're not a sub. How are you gifting subs when you're not a sub? 
That is some that is some unselfish stuff. Thank you, Vinny, and welcome Falstro. I thought you weren't a sub person. You have a sword. <laughs> That's true. Okay, green C56. Thank you so much. Vinny doesn't want to be seen to like you. Give train all aboard. Uh, blue at G23. Maintenance should only be performed by a qualified certified tech. By reading this manual, you waive any right to sue Pilotronics for death or dismemberment. <laughs> I should add that to the beginning of the stream. By watching this stream, you waive all rights to sue Luckless Lovelocks for, for death or dismemberment. Now I can reprogram those guard robots. Sweet. How do I actually do that, though? 30 or 40 gifts going around that one day? Wow. Yeah, which, um... That was when he was playing uh, RimWorld, right? You have two subs to odd? Can, is that actually possible? Welcome to the future! <laughs> Welcome, Vinny. Thank you for gifting a sub, Falstra. Welcome to the future, Ru. You can hide the, uh... You can hide, you can hide the, uh, sub badge, I think. Or the, or the mod badge. So how do I reprogram them? I can't go out there. Those SRO-1 robots oh, would kill me. I've read the manual. I should be able to reprogram the robots. Warning, SR-01 robots in patrol mode. Okay, so red E-3-4. Danger, danger, SR-01 robots in attack mode. Oh shit, green C-5-6. And then blue uh, G-2-3. SR-01 robots in maintenance mode. It is now safe to enter factory. That should disable the robots. It looks all clear now. You know what I should do is, um, Bleco, you are probably the most, the person that's most consistently here, that has been most consistently here for the longest. I should do this. There, now, now Bleco has three symbols. Now Blacko has three badges. I, I, I want I want Blacko to have more badges than Vinny. Why would Uncle Chuck need to make a human-looking robot AI? What was Uncle Chuck doing before he died? I think Uncle Chuck might still be alive. Why are all these computers on? Time to purge people. I think I think you get a sense for uh, when when to and when not to purge people. Um, here's the flow chart. What's their what's their username? Is it Vinny eight seven nine? Yes. Purge. No. Do not purge. <laughs> Wait, you can't purge Vinny. Uncle Chuck was up to something. These computers shouldn't be powered on. <laughs> abusing power, abusing mod powers already. That was Vinny. Careful, Vinny.
virus installed. What? A virus? Uncle Chuck must have been trying to cause damage to something. It's locked with a foolproof electronic locking mechanism. I can't stop. Okay, there. That picture looks familiar. Kind of like Thimbleweed Park without any buildings. It's locked. Of course everything's locked. Give me the dust. I don't want to close that. Wait. Oh, factory key. It won't fit there. Office key. Yes! Oh, we've seen this before. Ah. Huh. Seen this we've seen this many times. Great protection from UVA and UVB. Very important for pirates. No I don't think this glass has been washed. That looks like Uncle Chuck's journal. Pick it up. Pick it up. Pick up the use glass. Okay. You just scared the crap out of the UPS guy. <laughs> this game is a bit silly to a chammer. I kind of want to see, uh, it looks at the stream with chat integration to see how much of my nickname gets cut off with all those symbols. True. There is a UVA and UVB, yep. Yeah. Uh, entry 3668. It is true. A lot, a lot makes sense now. Where is Dolores' mother? Interesting. Been spending more and more time in the lab with the AI and our text adventure. It's unlocking some interesting mysteries. My previous assumptions about it and the world seem to be correct. Are we in his text adventure? In his adventure game? More research and falling deeper into the rabbit hole. Into this rabbit hole. Odd things I never considered before are making sense. Thimbleweed Park has 80 residents but 3,000 people in the phone book. It didn't make sense until I considered the impossible. Oh my god, this is terrifying. The AI says there's only one way, but I've started to suspect it. Is it telling me the truth? We're being watched. I am being watched. The AI is not what it says it is. I'm not convinced the AI is not an AI at all, but something else. Something from a different world. The same world the people from the phone book are from. It's talking about us. I created a small Tron tube that lives deep in my text adventure and is uncoupled from us. It keeps counting up and up. We must be resetting. I need to go deeper. The deeper I go, the less they can watch me. They aren't paying attention to what happens below. They're only watching at the surface. Fools. Franklin keeps trying to get the factory restarted to make stuffed animals. I can't let this happen. My world will be discovered. 
I need more power. Reverse radio transmissions might do it. So, Franklin died because he wanted to restart the factory to make stuffed animals instead of pillows. This could this could lead to more of a um, more of a reason why he was killed, a motive. So I'm coming out of the window, so I open the door right as he was about to knock and he jumped back. I wonder how often that happens. Franklin has been taken care of. I'd feel bad if he was my real brother. <gasps> Plot twist! Franklin called a foreign investor to come in and evaluate the factory for possible investment. The AI says I need to stop this. I don't know if I can trust the AI. Maybe I can. I have a plan to deal with the foreign investor. I'll set the gears in motion. I can't tell if everything is unraveling or coming together. Another reset. I can feel them now, even without the uncoupled tube. Which Hammer says, I once waited in a tree late at night for my pizza delivery person to pull up. I waited until she knocked, then jumped into the tree and went sprinting at her. I don't... You might have taken that a little too far, Twitch Hammer. She dropped my pizza? No shit, that's what I would do. I would throw the pizza at your face and run. The Game of Thrones level drama going on right now is too much to handle. I agree. My mind is literally exploding. I don't know if you guys can see that. I can feel them now, even without the uncoupled tube. The Pillowtron machine is done. The text adventure is perfect. I don't think they noticed. I can hide there. But before I go, I need to leave Dolores some clues. If anyone could figure it out, it's her. This has to stop. There's only one way. I'm sorry. Ignorance is truly bliss. If only I had stayed ignorant. I just let Franklin make his stuffed toys. We'd be rich and ignorant. Living in... Living in... I can't think about this. I'm born on Halloween. I born, you're born to scare people. Don't mention when ordering a pizza that your dog is hungry? Why not? This is my last journal entry. I'd say more, but they can read this. I've hidden the clues all around Thimbleweed Park. I need to be careful. They're not noticed by them. They need to think it was their idea. Dolores will see through it. Please, Dolores, be as smart and resourceful as I know you are. Goodbye. Has an awful lot of faith in me. Uncle Chuck was really creepy. Who was he watching? Looks like there's a trap door here. I think I've seen this painting somewhere before. Uh, Chuck is like in the text adventure and like there's some kind of blending between the text adventure and reality. And um, he was he was convinced that Dolores would be able to figure out whatever he's hidden around Thibbleweed Park. My brother waited one and a half hours, and everyone who worked there was um, Moroccan. None of them wanted to deliver that order. One of the groups uh, is terrified of dogs. Oh, I see. Please insert terminal boot disk. We have to find the disk. Have we found anything like that? It says Philip's dangerous device, and it has a red button and a speaker on it. Okay, I'm pushing it. Oh, I forgot! This is one of the endings! Fuck. I forgot about this. <laughs> I did this already. <laughs> Okay, let me just go. Okay, right. let's save it. Let's save it here. <laughs> That's right. I actually did finish the game already once.
Is Twitch totally freaking out for anyone else? It is for uh, Nippa. What's what's happening? Oh. Better not. Might remove the prince. Oh, the prince. How do I leave? Don't I have like a print kit? I can see the stream and everything, but it doesn't register that I'm logged in. Oh, weird. Might just glitch to look like you finished the game. <laughs> Who's got the print kit? Oh, I love carrying stuff. There's no more fingerprint powder left. Are you serious? I still have the brush, but no more fingerprint powder, and it's missing the fingerprint tape. You think you know what, Crafty? It's locked with a foolproof electronic locking mechanism. What do I have to do? Okay, there was a thing. Is this, is this like... Is this what I have to do? You know what the powder is going to be. Okay, let me just read this again because I've forgotten what this is. And entering the colossal dungeon cave, heading to the east will cause instant death. Colossal Dungeon Cave Quest 2. Okay. Don't we have that? Oh! Oh. Um. Uh, ThimbleCon? Hold on. We need to get the disc. Um, I was checking, maybe we have that game? Excuse me. I actually have no idea where I would get the powder. Don't delete cookie. It's my state-of-the-art Commodore 64 with dual 1541 floppy drives and a blazingly fast 1200 baud modem. I want to go to ThimbleCon for a second. What have I been doing? Playing a game.
playing an adventure game. You better you better look it up, Blecko. Pew, pew, pew. Oh, cutting edge computer technology. Oh, I'd love to talk to him, but I'm too shy. What with him being famous and all. It's a puzzle dependency chart. The secret to adventure game design. Mm -hmm. Crafty Might, you are confusing the hell out of me. I do I have no clue what you're hinting at. We already have what we need. Okay. Oh, the fine black soot. carrying stuff plenty of powder now what's what do I use for the tape I don't think I have anything that I can use as tape. Oh, so you you thought it was something else. So you were actually you thought you figured something out. You were wrong. It's covered with black dust. I see some clear fingerprints. What was your suggestion? What were you thinking? No, I'm curious. What were you thinking? Uh, tape. What can we use as tape? That's tape. Not really the tape that we're looking for. Not the tape I was thinking. It is tape though, that's the way this game works. Happy to help. It will only work in the non-existent Betamax player. Uh, but I can't really use the balloon. It's not like an item I can use. Hmm. Also a lizard? <laughs> Trying to think of where I could find tape. Secret. Sacred bunker. We gotta get in there somehow, too, I think. Hmm, I'm not sure.
convenience store, maybe. <clears throat> well, average joke got a sympathy laugh. I haven't been there yet. I uh, didn't know it was possible to reach this part without going through it. Which part are you talking about? Welcome to Quickie Pal. Can I help you find anything? You guys are being so goddamn cryptic. Wanna buy a fine leather jacket? I did go to the secret bunker. I haven't gone into it. I've been there, but I haven't gone into it. Let me know if I can help you find anything. It's a son of the police. <sighs> I'm I'm phoning a friend. I don't want to be lost for too long. It's all about progress. The cell phone has no reception. Welcome back to the Hint Tron 3000. Foster, you can give How hints. How can I help if I, you? You can give hints on this if if I'm. I'll 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 ask for hints. But I'm using the hint thing right now. What might Chuck have touched? Yeah, no, I've got that. There is a glass in Chuck's office in the factory. You can get a fingerprint from it. Yeah. Refill the fingerprint kit with soot from the fireplace in the mansion. Use the fingerprint kit on the glass and then use the tape from the post office. Use the tape uh, of the safe and check the post in the office. Mansion. Thank you. I Goodbye. honestly, like, that totally makes sense, but like, I. It's been so long since I've been to the post office, I would have not remembered that. Is that what you guys were thinking? What happened to the secret pizza truck in the forest? I haven't done anything with that yet. Why am I sparkly? Who's sparkly? No, not the bus station. I thought it as soon as the lady on the phone said it. <laughs> it's been so long since I've been there, I totally forgot. Like, I remember that the post office existed, but I, I would have not... I would have not thought to go there for tape, but it makes sense. Kind of. It honestly could be anywhere, though, in this game. Open all night, please mail something. It's a sticky tape dispenser. It Go easy on the tape. We're almost out. There's definitely a clear fingerprint here. Okay, so then I think I need to use the fingerprint. I know, I know what to do now. I know what to do now. Ryan, what's up? Yeah, it's been a while. How have you been, man? 
Why would the post office be up open at night? Why not? Wait, where did she go? Oh. Why is she here? No, I, I got this. I got this. It's covered with black dust. I see some clear fingerprints. Oh, no. Um, no. Give this. Thanks a lot. Send Dolores to do this. Who's naked? Dig Am I, I might have lost a bit of weight. I don't think I've lost too much. Diggin! 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 This is a government building. Yeah, who's who came in naked? Diggin! Welcome to the future, who? Hey, hey, Mitty! Thank you for gifting a sub to Ryan. Welcome to the future, Who. This. Yes. That worked. There's something inside. He's naked? Ryan, you're naked? Oh, I see. That kind of naked. It's a small black book. Pick it up. Chuck's password. Top secret. CompuServe. Comps123. Prodigy. Secret. Secret. Secret 2. The source. Office computer. Genie. Quantum Link. Habitat. BBS games. P.S. Think of better passwords. I'm not naked. He's tired all of a sudden. Okay. I was hoping a disc would be in there. The safe is open, but totally empty. So we have his passwords. Yeah, he's just, you killed him. Killed him with your naked comments. The only computer I can think of is this one, but it requires a disk, right? Terminal boot disk. Any ideas on where the terminal boot disk might be? If you haven't played this before? The Dark Sword, welcome. <laughs> also naked. Um. Terminal boot disk. I'm just trying to think, is there someplace else where I've, there's a computer where I could use those passwords? On the terminal feet disc, I guess. <laughs> I don't know what that was. Um, I don't think any of those passwords would work on the secret bunker. I 
Maybe I need to use my computer? I don't- I've never watched the IT crowd. I don't know what that is. <laughs> David, welcome. Watch some- someone play this already, but I really do uh, enjoy watching people struggle. What's that you do? Dig in! It's my state-of-the-art Commodore 64 with dual fifth. I need Uncle Chuck's computer to log in. It's a foolproof electronic locking mechanism. Nothing happens. Okay, let me let me save it. There is a sitcom about IT people from the UK. Yeah. No, this isn't a thumbprint thing. Whoa! Hold your horse arena! Whoa! Donation messages are so much pressure. Can I just throw money at the screen? Hypatia, you absolutely can. Thank you for the five dollars. Throw all the money you want at the screen. You don't even have to write a message. No pressure. No pressure. Thank you so much. No pressure whatsoever. Let's see which buttons are pressed. I was thinking I could probably use this device. Gotta be good for something, right? It doesn't seem to fit that. I'm sure it has a very important use near the end of the game. I'm gonna, I, okay guys, do you have a hint? Give me, give me a hint of what I should do next. I need, I, don't, I need to get the disc, the boot disc. I think that's the top priority. the poopsie on it. Turn off the game and turn it back on again. This is my last journal entry. I'd say more, but they can read this. I've hidden clues all around Thimbleweed Park. I think it has something to do with this. The hint book. It's a red gel decoder. Wait. Or this might be when we actually get into the adventure. We have to do this.
This is interesting. While in the chamber with the robots, issuing the secret debug word Fitz Fizzcum. Hard crash the game and take down the entire computer, forcing a lengthy reboot. That's like over here. A virus? Uncle Chuck must have been trying to cause a These computers shouldn't be powered on. Okay, I'm going to the hint line. Because I'm I'm lost. I need a little, a the cell little phone nudge. has no reception. Really turn off the game and turn it back on again. I wouldn't be surprised. This game's kind of meta. Welcome back to the Hintron 3000. How can I help you? <laughs> I need a hint. Maybe the conspiracists have ways to hack into computers. Conspiracists? Thank you. That's gotta Goodbye. be that's gotta be the um, the secret bunker, right? Did I miss something? Thimblecon? Did I miss something at Thimble Who? Did I miss something at Thimblecon? Hi! Anything I can interest you in? I'm selling comics, D&D manuals, and original Star Trek spec scripts. I have a level 7 wizard. Doug's a good D&D DM. Okay. <laughs> I love Star Trek. Okay. I want to live on the Enterprise. Okay. <laughs> I've read all these comics. Okay. <laughs> Goodbye. Good talk. I'm trying not to be convinced into buying any more figurines. I feel like this Spock cosplayer is ahead of our time. Starships in bottles, handmade. Can I try the question to win a free starship? Only one starship in a bottle is given out free per day. Come back tomorrow for another chance. But I won't be here tomorrow. Not my problem. Bye. You will not find better starships in a... <laughs> Looks like Marvin's cousin, Gary. It's a, it's a character from the upcoming adventure game called Robot Island. Oh, I'd love to talk to him, but I'm too sh Oh, cutting edge computer technology. All right, I need another hint. A disclaimer about the veracity of the information in the books. Books on UFOs, animation, and puppies. Shut up, Gaylord Cat. The sausage at the diner? You gotta be kidding me. Yeah, I did that. No, I did that. Yeah, and I got the hamburger thing. I, and I've got the ship. I think that's... I did get the ship. I'm going for another hint.
Welcome back to the Hintron 3000. How can I help you? You need to attend the secret meeting in the bunker in the forest. Use the computer in Chuck's office. I don't, I, that doesn't help me. You need a hacker's boot disk. Yes! Maybe the pizza flyer has some more hints on how to open the game. Oh, the fucking pizza Thank flyer? You. Goodbye. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. You win game. 175101. Ah, oh, I totally forgot about that. See, this this is just cuz it's been so long since I played this. 175101. You guys just had to say something about pizza. It's a security keypad. It's a security Use it! Keypad. Oh god. Oh man! How are these? Okay, these are the hints you guys gave me. Have you tried the sausage at the diner? And then ThimbleCon. Seven five three oh nine. Whoa, that's that's quite the the uh, contraption. <laughs> Dolores, Edward, are you gonna use your mind control ray on us? I uh. Out! 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 Before you change my mind. Uh, is that the wrong character? I have to watch the scene every time. I do. I have to watch the scene every time. Maybe ransom? I don't know. I guess I'll just try everyone. I guess I have. I have no clue. Who we're supposed to send? Great pig. Oh yeah. Well, we'll be back with a warrant. Okay, so no, no police. Uh, I think who had the thing? Yeah, she has it. So it's gotta be um, ransom, I guess. Go in, for Christ's sakes. <laughs> These games, I'm telling you, sometimes. Cookie, you gotta go to work? Okay. Have a great day at work. Don't work too hard. Wait, Jillian's here. You've been here the whole time, Jillian? Ransom, welcome to our important meeting. We were waiting for you. 
And don't forget to take your goodie bag before leaving. You're you're so quiet sometimes. Forget forget that you're here. Not that you have to chat. No one has to chat. Oh, <laughs> their goodie bag. What is this? We're starting the meeting now. Please gather up. Here we Hello go. all, thank you for coming to this very important informational meeting. I'm Brett Lockdown, and that's my brother Chet guarding the elevator. Brett Lockdown? <laughs> Hiya. First I have to ask, any feds here? No way. All right then, let's begin. Have you heard the signals? The government is controlling your mind. They are taking away your free choice. We are becoming mindless sheep with no control over our destiny. Fight back. Are you with us? Yeah. Squawk. Yes, I'm with you. Yeah. That's all for now. Stay vigilant. And don't forget to take a goodie bag before you leave. Hey, no pushing. Hey, no pinching. No shoving. No pushing. Hey, no pushing. Hey, no pushing. Squeal. No pushing. Squawk. <laughs> what? Current mood this scene. Okay. How thoughtful. What the f is this? We take. I already f got one. Okay, let's open it, I guess. It's pretty heavy. Uh, it's a brick wrapped in aluminum foil. Looks like a strange floppy disk. It says Silbury Hacker Boot Disk on the label. That's it? That's the whole meeting? <laughs> that's it. That's that's all I do here. That's the ha that's the conspiracist meeting. And it's just to get this disk. Thanks for coming. Stay vigilant. What is this place? It's our secret bunker. Brett built it so we can finally be safe from the government and their high frequency mind control waves. They only work above ground. This game is so good. You know you're crazy, right? You just think that because you've been on the surface too long, dude. If you stay down here, He's and the effects of the signals pizza wear off, slice. you'll realize how much sense this all makes. <laughs> or you could wrap your head in tinfoil and protect your brain. You, I ain't ruining my clown fro for some conspiracy nut job. Are you even a pizza guy? It's just a cover, so I can go find new recruits without drawing the eye of the man. It's like Brett always tells me you got to blend in oh and a yeah giant that's true slice of and pizza totally blends in here in a town that doesn't have a pizza joint right uh, exactly hide in plain sight slice of life into this game <laughs> nice for cigar why a pizza costume why not something less conspicuous like a clown costume duh like I'd go above ground without protection from the signals, you gomer. My whole pizza suit um. is lined with foil. Oh yeah, you're wearing a foil-lined pizza costume, and I'm the f gomer, moron. <laughs> how many? So how long can we keep this going for? How many morons have you recruited so far? I got quite a few of the town folk on board now. We got the Pigeon Sisters. George the Postman. There's only eight Carney people Joe, in town, right? DJ Cassie. We're growing, but we still got to keep it on the down low. I can't have the sheriff getting suspicious and trying to shut us down. Good thing there ain't anything suspicious about you, face. So it's like everyone but the sheriff. Do you really believe this conspiracy crap? Yeah, I welcome back, David. My brother. I'll have to watch Brett the IT crowd, like I guess. The I know. And he explained 
everything to me. Like how mucus phlegm secretly makes games that deny us free will, and CDs are a government conspiracy to prevent us from playing songs backwards and picking up their coded messages. Your brother's a balloon, kid. I believe it. Uh, you really love the clown if I had to guess. I would luckless be the smart girl and odd would be this clown. <laughs> And Prinzigar would be the pigeon. Rancid is your favorite character from the game? Hmm. I think I left my hot plate on. Gotta run. What a waste of time. Don't forget to take a goodie bag. I already got one. <laughs> I love that the whole point of that was to get the, like, the disc. And the... Carry I'm this for me. I'm sure this is, uh... Foil wrapped brick is going to be really important too, actually. That doesn't seem to work. Hard to unwrap. Oh, okay. It's a C. It's C4. <laughs> it's a brick of C4 explosive. Better be very careful with this. It's a sheet of aluminum foil. Okay, um, wow. Maybe we can blow the door open? Best kind of goodie bags? Just a brick, just a casual brick of C4. This should do the job. How do I set it off? Vinny, you'd be the, yeah, you'd be the, oh, maybe this? You'd be the drinking fountain. It doesn't seem to fit that. I'm sure it has a very I can't think of what I would use to set that off right now. Oh, am I invisible? Oh, when it's bright, I'm like invisible. Look, you guys can like see through me. Um, let me just uh, let me adjust that a bit. There we go. Oh, that's what you meant when I when you said I was sparkly. Oh, okay. Well, let's try the disc. Your work out. Okay, let's be really quiet then. Oh, that's so nice, David. Lovely open fire crackling away. Oh, that's great. I used to um, I used to live in a place that had a, a fireplace. It was awesome. It's like this old stone fireplace. It's booting up. Dolores, I feared you would come. Uncle Chuck? Where are you? I have uploaded myself into the Pillow Factory's master computer. Pillowtron? You uploaded yourself to Pillowtron? Not just the Pillowtron, but the Pillowtron 3000 TM. And I am now more intelligent and powerful than anyone in the world. The things I know would blow your mind. This is your mind. <laughs> this is your mind blown. 
And there is nothing you can do to stop me. The computerized world will bend to my every will. Uncle Chuck, you have lost your mind. No, Dolores, I have gained a mind. A more powerful mind. A mind linked to the fabric of creation. Join me, Dolores, before it's too late. I will not join you, Uncle Chuck. I will find you and stop this insane plan of yours. <laughs> Let the games begin. Okay. Find out what happened to Dad. Go deeper into the factory to find out what happened to Uncle Chuck. Okay, what's the password? Office computer? It's this one, right? HU96, blah, blah, blah. Last login eight days ago from Terminal 1. Hmm. Oh, you tweeted a picture. Oh, cool. Yeah, I want to check that out. Oh, that looks great. That looks absolutely wonderful. Can't even be a dick without messing up. Okay, uh, directory factory status. Factory status. Pillotron operational, main door open. Maintenance mode, floor machines operational, office door unlocked, robot hall deadly, laser hall deadly. Attack toe. Oh, um. I'm bad at tic-tac-toe. It's a draw! How do I guarantee victory in tic-tac-toe, guys? What are the steps? I used to know, but I've forgotten. It'll center. The only winning move is not to play. Um, bottom row. Uh. It's a it's a draw again. I thought there was like a, a, yeah, I thought there was like a formula for winning every time. Opposite corners, mark a third corner, uh, then fill wherever you need. Right. So like, uh, up here. Opposite corners. Thought you said it was. Um. Oops. Yeah. 
Even if you went first, you can always be countered. Oh, uh, so you can, you can, it, basically you can never win. Because you just play in the middle, right? And that blocks your move. Four players play correctly, it's always high. Okay. All right, let's try the adventure. Okay, okay, I need to, okay. Now I need to look at the uh, the hint thing. So it says, so we need to go. Um, don't go east. So we want to go west, I think. Do I need really need to write this down? Head the west and look around. There isn't much to see, but you might notice something important. Head to the west again. West and then west. Beam of light. And then fizz, fizz scum. In the chamber with the robots. Let's see. Let's see how this works. Okay, Julie's saying start in the middle. Uh, and the one on the left. Or I guess I'd want to go to the one on the right. Do the adventure. Go west. You wake up in the damp and da uh, damp and dank room. The floor is hard stone. Dim light is to your west. You're in the long stone corridor with an exit to the east and west. It smells of death. You're in a large room with a beam of light coming in from an opening above. A river can be heard to the north. I guess we try to go into the light. The opening is too high to reach. Look around. You're in a large room with a beam of light coming from an opening above. Path leads to a dead end. There is no way out except the way you came in from. That's so. There are strange cave paintings on the wall. Uh, fist come? You're not doing this without me. I want to be here too, please. Hey! Wait for me! Uh-oh. I think we're locked in here now. Yeah, we're screwed. Fools! You are trapped in the factory with no possible escape. My intellect now spans millions of tubes and is no match for your little brains. This is the last chance to join me before I destroy you all. Shall we take a vote? All in favor of joining Uncle Chuck inside the magical mind of the Pillotron 3000 TM and ruling the world with him say, I. Very well. All I would do it. Of being Rule the world. By robot claws and burned by lasers and remaining pathetic mortals. Say I. 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 Abstain. 
So be it. <laughs> no one say I don't support a strong democracy and the will of the people. <laughs> you will now all die. That, that was quick part seven. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay, I'm gonna save it here. I am going to take a break. I need some coffee and I need a snack. Trapped in a factory with a huge block of C4. What the fuck was that? Uh, that's a good question. How many parts are there? Let me let me look it up. We're on the last part! Part 8 is the last part! Oh! I gotta get out of this room. Okay, I'm gonna take a break, five minute break, grab some coffee and a snack, and we will finish this game! Yes! So close to finishing. I can't wait. That'll be two games in two weeks. I will be right back. Thank you guys so much for the support. Uh, Hypatia, thanks for the donation. Vinny, thank you for gifting.